precious people welcome to yoga for being with me neha and uh, today we are starting with the first conscious yoga session today we'll be starting with the foundations of yoga you know uh, if the foundation is not good let's say of a building it's going to fall very soon so it's important to understand the foundations the roots first let's have the grounding and then we're going to go step by step in the postures and the sessions right so let's get started the first posture of uh, conscious yoga sessions is tarasana uh, tarasana means the mountain pose uh, you know before i tell you about the posture i want to tell you we carry a lot of mountain in our head as well of our challenges of our problems so today is a time when we become that mountain and experience what's happening in the mind uh, what kind of thoughts we are experiencing or you know what are the feelings we have in us at that very moment when we're doing the posture a uh, lot of people come to me and say neha i want to learn this or that uh, but the first and the very important thing in yoga is to have focus so tarasana will help you bring focus and balance and then step by step we'll be working on the other parts of our body and the other areas of our life right so uh, if uh, in case uh, you know you have headache uh, migraine or insomnia uh, or even low bp i would uh, recommend you not to do this posture uh, we can do other postures for that right and uh, in case uh, you feel that you know no you want to get directly into the head stand so i would suggest you to first stand upright right uh, this posture is also also known as samasthiti which means uh, uh, you know stillness uh, feeling absolutely sthir like i have been saying sthirta 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 centered so uh, let's start with tarasana and it's going to help you uh, stretch your spine a little it's going to help you uh, physical and mental balance uh, that's about it let's get started So before I tell you a step by step process to get into tarasana I would like to tell you that there are times when we don't even stand straight we put all our body weight on one side of the body like this hey what's up <laughs> or like this or maybe you know putting all our body weight on the toes do you see how I'm just falling or maybe Okay, I'm about to fall. So this is how we usually stand because uh, you never know what's happening in the mind, and that's making you go a little out of balance. So here we'll come into the balance, and here we will get in the posture. So to start with, uh, understanding uh, that we have to go from the roots till the crown. The energy will be rising up till here. So first we will be putting all our body weight on the feet and how to do that so if you see do you see the difference here my right big toe has gone a little above the left big toe so let's not keep this one behind stretch a little expand widen up and there we are so this is just the basics here now from here we'll take the energy up to the knees we we'll lock the knees we'll keep the thighs firm roll our shoulders back and without making the lower back stiff just make sure that that you're not making the lower back stiff here and now when you do this the shoulders back you'll see that your chest has automatically come forward but at the same time you might be feeling like this so that's the time when we when you need to come back taking all the energy from the roots up to the thighs to the groins to the navel chest widen your fingers and facing me if you're doing it <laughs> So this is how tarasana is done. Now, this is the moment where you'll feel, oh, I'm falling. I'm gonna fall. So this is the time when you need to keep gazing at one point. Pick up a point in front of you, maybe somewhere on the floor. Keep looking at that point and keep breathing. 
remember the fluctuations of the mind. This is how we remove the fluctuations by looking at the point, having an absolute gaze and focus. Keep breathing deeply. And automatically you will start to feel a little stillness in your body and your mind. Great, isn't it a great way to start having a little silence within yourself and then getting in the posture, right? Uh, so now there are different ways of doing the third asana. Another way to do is taking the block if you have it and putting between the thighs. So automatically you'll feel that your thighs have become firm. I feel firm. And from here, once again, roll the shoulders back. And now you will notice that your feet is automatically, all the four corners of your feet is automatically pressing on the mat. It's pretty interesting. And your body won't move. But make sure that you're looking at a point and you're breathing. If you're not breathing, I don't know what's gonna happen. <laughs> make sure that you're breathing. Another way to do Tadasana is, which is the variation and uh, once you master this, well we are not really mastering but uh, once uh, you get in this posture after practicing it for a couple of times, you would want to get in the next level of Tadasana. Again, once again, uh, bring the feet together, knees together, body straight. Like I said, if you want, you can keep a little distance. If you want, you can just bring your hands on the sides and keep the feet together. And from here, we're gonna go and touch the sky. It's far, okay. So I'm not gonna touch the sky, but at least I'm just gonna raise my hands up in the air. From the sides, we're gonna raise our hands, inhaling on the sides. Stretching the spine like I said to you. And now, if you're feeling a little oh, in your shoulders and your neck, just relax a little. And the back of your palms are facing each other. But this is not it. This is yoga. So we'll get into the real posture here. Once you're here, once you feel a little steadiness, very slowly and gradually looking at that point, that you're looking at, start to raise your heels very slowly. And be here for a few breaths. And let's put a thought in our mind today. I am becoming focused and balanced in all the areas of my life. I am removing all the blockages that doesn't let me be focused. Stretching our hands up as much as you can and slowly and gradually bring your heels down and hands down from the sides stay here for a couple of breaths keeping your eyes closed keeping a nice and gentle smile on your face experiencing focus and balance that goes hand in hand.
How is it? Great. That was Tarasana, the mountain pose, and uh, this is just the foundation of yoga. I hope you liked it. And if you liked it, please share it with people. Please do subscribe to my channel, and uh, make sure that you spread this knowledge that we have been given in our country. This is very basics of uh, having a beautiful and a successful life. So I'm going to see you in the next session, the next conscious yoga session. Thank you so much. Spread the love.